Welcome back to Richard Burns Rally with Mystex. This is my USA at Fraser Wales time trial. This is video number three. We are driving the Toyota this time. First run is always default setup with long gear ratio. Second setup is a custom setup of my own, still long gear ratio. Just trying to see what kind of time differences I get. Pretty sure that just starts as default before you load anything. I would say yes. Okay, so gears. Long. Okay, we save it. Default setup, long ratio. Load it just to make sure, and all right, here we go. First run, default setup in the Toyota Corolla. This is the first car I drove when I very first played this game. Three, Let's see how she two, is now. One, go. Flat left, thirty into caution bump. Keep left, thirty medium left tightens caution bump into. Right, 70. Make sure you go slow enough around that corner. 30, fast right, long, 100. This car is floaty, but nowhere near as floaty as the other two. That's default setup. Right, right, into caution, bump. I lost it. Flat right, 150. Still going flat out. Fast left, tightens, 100. Hard on the brakes. Down into fourth gear. Easy right, I can go around that a little bit faster, I think. It's about how fast I've been going fast around left, it. But 70. Might be a little bit faster of a corner, Easy but right, we're sure. 50. Keep middle, over crest, flat left, 100. Over crest, into fast right, 100. Jumps fairly well, I mean. Flat left, 50. It's not bad, but I mean. Tightens, 30, easy right into keep middle over crest. I'd have to say the default setups are all pretty good. Easy right, 100. Caution, bump, and flat left, 100. Over crest, really can't go wrong with it. They're right, all a little 70, floaty, right, but. Over crest, easy left. At least keeps the car pretty Easy safe left. over bumps. Over crest. You don't get Flat thrown all around. 50. Flat right. Over crest. Easy right. If you don't know what you're doing, you can pretty easily screw the car up to where it'll get launched over bumps. Finish. 206.30. That's the best default time I've had. Not bad. 206.30. That's actually better than my, that's actually better than my Subaru 2003 second attempt that I did, which, given if I were to go back, I might do a little bit better with it, since I've been making all these videos progressively at one time. Not a bad time, this car actually feels really good default setup. It feels the best out of all of them. I think it has something to do with how small it is. I think it's the lightest car out of the first two anyway. I was even doing that. I did keep my foot pretty much to the floor though. Even though we were going off road. If 
opened out flat out. Whew, bounced a little bit there. The rear definitely seems to be pretty bouncy over big jumps, but it wasn't unsettled, it just looks a lot worse in the replay than it actually felt. interested to drive are the MG and the new Sonra Citroen. I haven't driven the Citroen. I have driven the MG. It's front wheel drive, which is interesting in its own right. Okay. I think the torque change, the differential changes in this car are going to make a pretty big difference. I have high hopes for a new fast lap. Okay, here we go. Now we do our own setup. I will load my default long ratio and I will adjust it from there. Put the torque up to 750, 350, and about 640. I don't want to use a handbrake. Put this to 30. Try pretty much the same settings in these cars. Soften the front a little bit. See the front? The front bump is pretty stiff on this car, and the rear is pretty soft. I'll put that up to 4.7. Okay. Springs. I like to have the rear just slightly taller. Everything else there is pretty good. Give the rear about... We'll go 0.36. Go one on the strut platform, and up like put my steering lock down to 446. Okay. Save. Okay. Now load it just to make sure. Custom setup. All right, here we go. Custom setup. Second attempt. The Toyota Corolla. Let's see if we can set a new fast time. I almost set it with the default. So. Three, two, one, go. I'm pretty good about this. Flat left, 30 into caution bump. That differential makes it accelerate Three, so much faster. Hard on the brakes, down the third right, gear. 70. Oh, it handles Each well. Left, 30, fast I like it. Home. Down into fourth, slide it around the corner, and hard on the gas. Flat out. Caution bump. Just lift just a tiny bit, and then back on the accelerator. Oh, that feels good. Big jump, don't lose it. Hard on the brakes. Fourth gear. Easy right, 70. Fast left, 70. Car feels substantially Easy better. Right, 50. Keep middle over crest, flat left, 100. Over crest into fast right, 100. Flat left, 50. I'm getting, I'm getting better at the track too, which helps obviously. It's fast left. Hey, those guys aren't there this time. Oh, hang on to it. Woo. A little bit of wheel spin there. Going wide. Easy 
All right. 20409. Again, new fast lap. 20409. Very good. That's a little over a second quicker with that car. See, I don't know. I'm going to save it again. I may try it. Not now, but later I will. So again, we set another fast, fastest time with my custom setup. Seems to work on all the cars pretty effectively. This little car is quite good. We have to do another season with it. Or I may just do some more of these time trial events, really. Might do some... Might just do one from Britain, Britain maybe, next time? I like that place quite a bit. Could go do the Japan stages, or Australian ones as well, since I don't really know them very well. Be more of a learning experience. It got through there better that time. It, it wanted to get loose, but it didn't. It's funny, I like I said.